CAU. If you're trying to grow your business, add diversity. What you do? It'll climb the tracks in university. When it comes to getting clients, you face adversity. You need to hit up climb the tracks in university. Climb the tracks, 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 Profit, freedom, and impact. Go to paydadplaybook.com. If you're trying to grow your business, add diversity. What you do? Hit up client of trace in university. Hey, when it comes to getting clients, you face adversity. You need to hit up client of trace in university. Hey, hey. Paydadplaybook.com. That's P A I D ad playbook.com. Hey, what's up, my friends? Dr. Marco Russell, the king of client attraction, and welcome to this brand new episode of School of Client Attraction. And if you're watching this video, I'm curious if you desire to build a million dollar coaching business, what are the seven pillars that you want to be following? And I broke them all down in a live stream that I'm going to give you access to right now, and that's going to be today's episode. So let's go ahead and jump into it right now. Be sure to take notes. So today's training, we're going to, so every single week I do these, every, every, do, every do these every Tuesday, unless I'm traveling or something comes up where, I'm conflicted, right? So we've been doing these probably every Tuesday for the past two years, and we've only had to adjust the date maybe once or twice. Notice I didn't say we've had to cancel it once or twice. We've had to adjust the date, maybe about four times, right? I can count them on my hands for sure. But we're here every single Tuesday. Some weeks we do ask me anything sessions where you can literally ask me anything you want, and I coach you on the spot and give you real-time feedback on what you can apply into your business. Some weeks we do marketing reviews, like last week we did marketing reviews, and basically doing the marketing reviews, I review your marketing on the spot, whether it's your funnels, whether it's your ads, whether it's your flyers, your Instagram, your emails, whatever it is, whatever marketing materials you have that you want feedback on, I do it in real time and give you real-time insights on what to actually go implement to actually make your marketing more profitable. And then some weeks, like this week, we actually do a topic, like a topic-based training. In today's topic, we're going to dive into seven pillars to a million-dollar coaching or consulting business. So if you're a coach or you're a consultant and you're looking to grow your business to 100000 a month, you want to know exactly the simple way to get to a million dollars a year, I'm going to show you exactly step-by-step step how to do it. Now, I am not making a claim. I'm, I'm going to just do a disclaimer. I am not saying that by you listening to this training, you're going to go out and make millions of dollars a year or $100,000 a month. I'm also not saying... Um, that if you implement some of the stuff I'm saying, you're going to make a million dollars a year. I'm not saying that if you implement every single thing that I say, you're going to make a million dollars a year. I don't know you personally. I don't know your business. I don't know your work ethic. I don't know your ex experience. I don't know any of that type of stuff. So this is for educational and example purposes only. So this ain't, this ain't me making a claim in any way, shape, form, or fashion, right? Because it's a lot of different variables that come with building a successful business, specifically a multi-million dollar business or a million dollar business. So I'm not here to make absolutely any claims, all right? Without that being said, uh, what to date, we've helped our clients do over $1 billion in revenue by applying the strategies that I'm about to actually show with you right now. So I will say that, but again, I can't make any claims because there's a lot of different variables. I just want to throw that out there real quick. All right, with all that being said, let's get to it. So when it comes to building a seven-figure coaching or a consulting business, everyone really loves to chase the shiny new object, whether that's selling courses, whether that's selling coaching, whether that's selling consulting, every, it's still the same thing, right? So people start chase, chasing all the shiny objects. So they chase the IG shout outs. They chase like dancing on TikTok. They chase um, or Instagram, right? Or they chase, you know, doing the five-day challenges. They chase testing new tripwire offers every 30 days. So like, you know, trying to sell this ebook or sell this little ticket offer. Or they test like doing a webinar, right? All this different type of stuff, right? Et cetera, et cetera, et cetera. When in reality, the recipe to the $100,000 per month is really simple, okay? All you require is a few things. I actually should change that right here. All you require is... One compelling offer, right? One compelling offer. Now, an offer isn't your product or your service or your program. That's your, that's what you sell. The offer is how you position it, right? So I always I like to use this example. So Domino's sells pizza. That's their product. Pizza Hut sells pizza. That's their product. 
Little Caesar sells pizza, Blaze sells pizza, right? However, Domino's, at one point, I'm not sure they're marketing now, but I know at one point their marketing was hot, fresh pizza in 30 minutes or less, right? And that's when their company blew up. Hot, fresh pizza in 30 minutes or less. That was their offer, right? The Yes, the product was pizza, but the offer was hot, fresh pizza in 30 minutes or less, right? So what is your offer, right? You want to have one compelling offer. Ideally, you sell it for $3,000 to $10,000 or more. So one compelling offer that you sell for $3,000 to $10,000 or more, okay? That way, you only require a handful of clients, okay? Now, I'm going to get to these. We're going to have some time. We're gonna have some time. We, have, we should have a little time for questions at the end as well. So one compelling offer. That's number one. Number two. You want to have one predictable, scalable traffic channel to generate appointments, people to apply to work with you, right? So predictable, scalable. So that could be Facebook ads. That could be TikTok ads. That could be um, YouTube ads. That could be Google ads. That could be LinkedIn ads, right? It could be a mixture of Facebook and Instagram ads. Predictable and scalable. The only traffic channels that are predictable and scalable are paid advertising channels, right? Paid advertising strategies. So organic content is great. And I'm going to talk about that in a second, actually. And it has its place, but it's not predictable and scalable, right? Because you don't know what the algorithms are going to do, right? The algorithm, they change the algorithms all the time. We saw what Instagram has been doing lately. They just changed their whole thing around. People get affected all the time. People who do SEO, um, like search engine optimization, they get knocked out you know, because of a new update, all these different things. So you want to have one predictable and scalable traffic channel that you can actually generate appointments predictably, uh, consistently, and scalably. So figure out what that is. All right, let's keep going, y'all. Now, next, you want to have one client attraction system convert those leads into book costs. So here's the thing. Most people, they sell low ticket offers. Most people, they tell you that if... You want to get high ticket clients, you got to sell them something low ticket first. And that's absolutely false. It actually complicates the pro process unnecessarily, right? Um, Because you got people buying stuff they really don't need when you can just sell them your premium price offer. That's why we came up with the elevator funnel. Because yeah, you can take people up the Ascension stairs, like $7 product to $47 product to $97 to $297 to $497 to $97 to $2,000 to $5,000 to $15,000, whatever. Yeah, you can take them that way. And that works. I know people who make millions doing that. However, I believe that you go high value free content, invite them to a premium experience, right? If they they like your high value free stuff. And then if they do, then you offer them the opportunity to work with you on a deeper level so you can help them with the transformation. So that's the elevator. So you can take people up the stairs or you can take people up the elevator to get them to the results that they want even faster. And that's what people want. And people will pay you a premium for speed to get them where they want to go. So you want to have your one client attraction system to convert those leads into book calls. Next, you want to have one multi-layered follow-up process. You want to have one multi-layered follow-up process, right? So the age-old the age old quote is what? The fortune is in the follow-up. Well, why don't most people follow up, right? Why don't more people follow up, right? Why? Because most people, they run ads and if people don't buy, they don't have any follow-up, they don't have any retargeting or none of that. So I'm going to give you all a multi-layer follow-up strategy that you can implement now. So Shan said, to answer your question, I mean, they're marketing and legal services. Got it. So expertise is project management. I mean, you can coach people on project management, help become, people become more efficient. Um, you, also, your expertise is law of attraction. I mean, you can create, um, that's a, both of those project management and law of attraction are both multi-million dollar coaching programs, right? So when somebody becomes a lead, you want to have a follow-up sequence in place. So you want to have that. So your follow-up emails, you want to have retargeting. So how many of you, it feels like I'm following you around the internet. You see my ads everywhere, right? That's because you're being retargeted based on the pixel. So you want to have that in place. Also, really take things to the next level. You want to have a text marketing follow-up as well. People don't always check their emails, but they're more likely to check their phones. So you want to have that in place. Now, there's more stuff you can add to it. But if you just had those three things, right, 
total game changer for your multi-layer follow-up process. Okay, let's keep going. Next, you want to have one content conversion system. So what's a content conversion system? Well, content conversion system is creating daily content because when you create content, for those of you who are doing ads or want to do ads, when you create content, the con- your content actually makes your ads 300% more profitable. Your content actually makes your ads 300% more profitable. Why? Because when people see your ads, they're typically going to go look you up. And then when they go look you up, you want to have a process in place where they can actually binge watch your content before they actually show up to the call to buy something from you, right? If you don't have any content in place, they can't binge watch it. So you want to be creating daily content. How many of you are creating daily content every single day for your ideal audience? And you're actually uploading it. Some people I talk to, they're like, well, I got content, but it's on my phone. If the, if the videos are on your phone, it's not content, right? It's, it's not content. You got to put it up so other people can actually view it. If you don't, you miss the most. So you want to have, what is your content conversion system? Do you have one? Do you do one reel and you put that reel on Instagram, TikTok, and YouTube for YouTube shorts and Facebook and using that same piece of content? And then I'll email it to your list. What is your process? Okay. And then you want to have one effortless enrollment process. You want to have one effortless enrollment process. So what's the effortless enrollment process? Well, many of you have probably heard me say, Great marketing makes selling unnecessary. Great marketing makes selling unnecessary. So when you do the marketing right, people actually show up ready to give you money, right? They show up ready to give you money because your marketing has done the selling for you, right? The marketing has done the selling for you. Now they know how great you are. Now they show up ready to buy versus you being on the phone having to convince them. So the enrollment process is not a sales call. It's an effortless enrollment because you're interviewing them and they're auditioning to show you why you should allow them to buy. So they're convincing you why you should allow them to buy versus you trying to convince them why they should buy. Okay. Very, very critical distinction to keep in mind there. Right. Very, very critical distinction to keep in mind. So you want to have one effortless enrollment process. We give our clients a thing called the seven figure script. I mean, I don't know if y'all are interested in that, but. That's what they typically do. And it's like, because some people are like extremely uncomfortable selling. So we give them the seven figure script and they just read it. So they get on the phone with people, they, get, they, they, they just read it and then people will pay them. Right. And some people don't. I ain't going to lie to you and just say everybody buys. No. Typically, a good rule of thumb is about 20% buy. Right. We just had a client, he just posted in a group. I just saw it a few minutes ago. And he was like, um, he had a $10,000 a day. Right. From using the effortless enrollment script. And all I had to do was read it. He had a brand new coaching offer, the whole nine, right? So one effortless enrollment process. Let's keep going. And then lastly, before I kind of go deep, because I got some other stuff I want to share as well. Most people skip this. You got to have, after you do all of this, you got to have one world-class fulfillment process, right? You got to have one world-class fulfillment process. So a lot of people talk about marketing. A lot of people talk about sales. A lot of people talk about all that different type of stuff. But most people don't talk about how do you actually fulfill and serve those individuals who just paid you money. So it's like people say, people are like, all right, marketing and sales is one thing, but people don't really understand that the world-class fulfillment, like when, when people pay you, how do you take care of them? What is the experience like when you get their money? Or do you do like most people, You go ghost once you get the money or you're not as excited about helping them more as you as you get the money. I mean, we've all experienced it. Right. Once you cut the check, you know, people kind of go. It's like it's like where's Waldo. Right. You got to find them. So you want to make sure when people give you their money. They actually are like, okay, this was the best investment I ever made. Right. And people don't really realize that fulfillment and delivery are actually marketing functions. Because when you take care of people, guess what? They're going to go out and they're going to tell other people about you. Now they basically become part of your team because they're like, okay, this was amazing. I got to go tell other people, other people about it. Okay. So you got to have one world-class fulfillment system, fulfillment process rather. Okay. And that's it. I mean, that's the secret to building a business that does $100,000 per month, 
um, as a culture consultant, whether you work 80 hours a week or 10 hours a week. And that's the mind shift you need to make. Like if you want a business to become a, if you want your business to become a true cash flow generated asset that operates independent of your time. So even when you're on vacation, you can board your plane and see strike notifications coming in, lighting up your phone right up until you take off, all because your team is working hard behind the scenes and you got this process in place. This is the process that you got to follow. That's all I got, y'all. Look, if y'all want, I know these spots are filling up really, really fast. So if you want to get one of these complimentary rapid growth planning calls where we jump on the phone with you and help you map out a specific game plan to actually help you get more leads that convert into clients so you can actually turn your annual income into your monthly income, I highly recommend taking action right now. Just comment CAU. Just put If you're on Facebook, put CAU in the comment section. Again, this is not a sales call. I'm waiving the fee for the call. This is specifically all about you. you don't have, you're not paying anything. You're not, you're not going to be sold anything on this call. Any of that type of stuff. Um, but it's a specific game plan. They help you map out a game plan because I don't like to do these live streams and y'all ain't like got a plan to implement because information is no good without implementation, right? Shan said, CAU, congrats, Shan. So yeah, I don't like to just give information if you don't got a plan to implement. So that's why we do these calls. It makes you come away from these calls, away from company, these live streams with a plan to implement, all right? So that's that. If you're on Facebook, just put CAU, just like Shan did in the comment section. Put CAU in the comment section. If you're on Instagram, just put just send me a direct message in the direct message. Put CAU in the direct message. Thank you so much for checking out this episode. Have a phenomenal day because you absolutely deserve it. Talk to you soon. What's the difference between you and mega successful coaches and consultants with a dream business? Simple. They're getting more leads than you are. What if there was a way to get 50 to 100 leads every single day like clockwork? Would you want it? then go to www.getdailyclients.com to access our paid ad playbook that has brought in millions of leads for our clients over the years on complete autopilot. This is the podcastfactory.com.